Dragon Ball Super Manga Chapter Number 25 has now officially been revealed, having to be translated in English. You guys can go on ahead and find the official link down below if you want to go on ahead and take a look at the latest manga chapter. As of course, in which we're about to see, this manga chapter definitely separates itself from what we saw in the anime. Now with that, we kick it off with Dragon Ball Super Manga Chapter Number 25, exactly where we left off, with Merge Zamasu having to battle a mastered Super Saiyan God Goku. Now if you take a look at the overall details back and forth, it looks like Goku and Zamasu are having a much more difficult struggle against each other than originally presumed. We take a look at how Zamasu is in fact struggling against a mastered Super Saiyan Blue Goku, as Goku is also indeed having a very difficult time against Merge Zamasu himself, and by the end of it, it looks like just when you thought Goku was down and out, Goku would always figure out a way on how to counteract, and even which there was a scene where Goku gets knocked on down to the ground, and just when you thought all hope was lost for Goku, he goes on ahead to raise his left Left hand and firing a ferocious key blast in Zamasu's direction, in which catches Zamasu, and which forces Goku to be on the offensive yet again. As Trunks even says, it's incredible. Goku's attacks aren't even letting up, at least. In the overall idea that at this very point, Goku is indeed tired, he's actually struggling, and this is a battle of time to see which one between Zamasu and Goku are gonna cave first. But Torio Taro did an amazing job. If you pay attention to detail, if you pay attention to the way Merge Zamasu is fighting with Goku, I would have definitely have preferred to see this kind of a battle in the anime than how we saw it originally when it first aired. However, if you take a look at what's going on, it looks like Goku is able to hold his own and even physically damage Zamasu, in which I highly disagree with. Even as a Master Super Saiyan Blue, I think that Goku should not be anywhere near the same caliber in being able to damage a Potara fusion. But nonetheless, as the fight drags on, we see how later on everyone's observing how Goku and Zamasu are knocking each other down with Zamasu having to say I, I am an immortal with Goku having to lie down and both of them are seemingly tired and then at that very point we see how Zamasu is looking to take things to a whole nother level as he begins to tear off his shirt and he says I cannot be damaged in which he regenerates himself but as he's regenerating himself Goku manages to quickly catch Zamasu off guard and trying to attack him from behind Behind. And Goku realizes that the more Zamasu regenerates, the greater the threat of Zamasu will be, as Goku even says, there's no way I can't just let you sit there and recover, damn, I don't have much time in being able to fight in this form either, as Goku is beginning to get tired as well. In which we see Trunks says, Goku seems to be acting a little strange, with Vegeta having to say, Kakarot's body is probably already at its limit, with Trunks having to say, what? How is that? With Vegeta having to respond by saying, his body is is unable to store and endure the power of blue. So it looks like even despite his battle, Goku is trying to keep the capacity of Super Saiyan Blue stable without burning right through his form. And even with that, we see Zamasu, in which I love his detail in this manga, the way he looks, his overall muscular stature, it looks very different than how we saw it in the overall anime. And we see how Zamasu puts his hands down and he's slowly standing up. And Goku says, if it comes down to this, then and I got no choice but to go all in. So it looks like Goku is in fact up to something, and we see Zamasu, he's tired, he's breathing heavy, and of course, I mean, again, I disagree with the idea in having Goku be able to keep up with such a person, but Zamasu then says, you, you, you accursed Saiyan, I'm through with this earth, and I'm through with this universe. I'll wipe you out alongside this entire galaxy from existence, and Zamasu begins to power up and I personally think this was one of my favorite scans, one of my favorite pages from the manga itself. I mean, if you look at the overall, you know, masculinity of, of, of Zamasu and you look at how he looks and how ferocious he looks, he looks like he's turning into Broly, he looks like he's turning into Bojack, he's muscular, his aura is pouring out everywhere, he's angry, and he's looking to destroy the entire universe alongside Son Goku, in which he's not playing any more games, and then we see how Zamasu continuously pours out his energy more and more, and that's that's when Vegeta says his aura is overflowing out of his injured damaged body. If he lets that much power explode without recovering his stamina, no matter how immortal he is, he's not going to be able to cope with that. With his mind
mind blinded by rage, he's no longer able to properly compose himself in the burden of his body. So it looks like Zamasu is thriving on anger, he's thriving on rage, he's angry, he's upset that Goku has done this to him, and where have we seen that before? We've seen that with Saiyans. Saiyans normally thrive off of emotion, off of anger, so this must come from the Goku Black side of things and within his body. With Trunks having to say so much power and at that very point merge Zamasu begins to charge straight at Goku as Goku seems to be compressing his energy in his hand and I will say when when we saw them collide the artwork the artwork is absolutely phenomenal despite if you guys agree or disagree with the overall direction of the manga you have to give credit to the way the anime looks in comparison to the manga the manga details are just spectacular and of course as Zamasu is trying to strike Goku we see how Goku quickly teleports behind Zamasu and of course the moment we've all been waiting for Goku sticks his hand out Zamasu says what and that's when Goku says Beerus sorry for calling this a dangerous technique before but I'm gonna have to borrow it from you destruction Hakai and that is when Goku indeed does use the Hakai move now whether or not you guys agree or disagree with them having to do a quote-unquote ass pull on this it is confirmed as seen in the scan and on your screen that Goku borrows Beerus's technique in using the Hakai in the mastered Super Saiyan form against merged Zamasu and just as that is happening you get to see Zamasu begin to get erased we see him decomposing we see him dematerializing right before Goku's eyes and we see that look in Zamasu's eyes and that's when Trunks says wait a minute whoa and Vegeta having to say wait that's Beerus's technique so we see right then and there that everyone already knows that this is Beerus's technique and just as Zamasu is getting erased we see him begin to smile he opens up a portal and just on the other side of that portal he grabs Mai and he pulls her through he puts her in front of of Goku and he says I dare you with Goku having to say what are you doing put her down and he's using her as a shield so he doesn't get fully hakai and in the meantime he manages to outsmart Goku and kicking him in the ribs and that's what pretty much was the straw that broke the camel's back because Goku dropped and he reverted back to his base form with everyone having to call Zamasu's bluff he only used Mai as a temporary distraction in order to gain Goku's attention so his entire left side is gone and then at that very point he begins to regenerate we see how he pulls himself back together and he fully recovers by getting his suit back and then he says for the god who stands at the pinnacle of all creation to have to resort to such a crude method of winning I will never forgive you. I must engrave this session onto my heart and never again shall a mortal. And then that's when someone says, Zamasu. So as he's having a moment to himself, as he's talking, we see how Trunks begins to come out of nowhere and he wants to go on ahead and try to slash down Zamasu, but of course fails. So Trunks attempts to slash Zamasu and completely flops on over. And that's when Zamasu says, never again shall a mortal be created that is. I mean, because he wants to go on ahead and destroy all mortals and saying, I will never see the day where a mortal shall be created. And Vegeta right then and there says, it's all over. And Zamasu says, what a pain. I guess I'm going to have to erase this entire earth from existence. He puts his hand down and just as Zamasu is about to erase the earth and the entire universe, all of a sudden he begins to decompose. He begins to separate. We see part of Goku Black and we see part of Zamasu and they're beginning to separate sort of like Siamese twins and everyone is shocked and then we see the Supreme Kai say wait a minute it's been exactly one hour it's been exactly one hour since Zamasu's fusion they have finally separated but as they begin to separate they seem to be solely attached to each other everyone's freaking out and that's when even Gowasu and Supreme Kai are talking and Gowasu having to say over this past hour they've likely become bound on a cellular level fusion or not the both of them are still Zamasu one and the same with Supreme Kai having to say but this is completely different than when Goku and Vegeta became unfused with Gowasu having to say both of the Zamasus are refusing and the undoing of the fusion so it looks like they don't want to separate they don't want to separate and it looks like unlike Goku and Vegeta who are forced to separate Zamasu on the other hand refused
uses and at that very point since they're struggling to go on ahead and stay together trunks emerges and cuts them down from behind and goku having to see this it's because of trunks who cut them apart in which permanently separated their fusion and i do have to say that the way this looks from behind we see how trunks cuts down zamasu he cuts down black and they look all gooey lots of blood guts and gore and trunks is tired he's pandering and of course as the bodies drop between black and zamasu trunks takes his sword he goes behind goku black and he stabs him right in the spine this is very very graphic and i understand as to why they would never want to show this in the anime but i love how trunks tries to avenge his mother to avenge his family to avenge the world and stabbing the very person that caused you all this pain and as he stabs him we see how trunks powers down and he says this is the end for you black and that's what supreme kai says trunks defeated black everyone is happy goku says you did it you protected the earth and I, I, oddly enough zamasu's still there black is still there and everyone's rejoicing that you know trunks had finally defeated black and then out of nowhere we see how you know black's fingers begin to move then his hand begins to move and then we see how black turns around and he blasts trunks on down to the ground he shoots trunks down and he's smiling so this is unlike anything we've ever seen you know in the actual anime so black shoots down trunks trunks drops on down to the ground and we see how black stands up with the sword still in his body and goku having to say but you you're not supposed to be immortal too what's going on and black takes the sword behind of him he slowly pulls it out of his spine which again i love this manga chapter so much for that he slowly pulls the sword out and then he takes the sword and crushes it he crushes the sword and then we see how black's face begins to morph and it's in fact merge zamasu so everyone's confused nobody knows what's going on vegeta's like what goku's like what in the world you know how how does he have that form i mean they're separated right and just as that happened, Goku begins to back up and he bumps into another Zamasu in which that Zamasu transforms into another merged Zamasu. And Goku's like, wait, I mean, this one's got the same face too. Like, what the heck is going on? And that's when two merged Zamasus are beginning to beat down Goku. And that's when Vegeta says, there's two fused Zamasus. How is this possible? So now, instead of fighting one, they're fighting two. And one merged Zamasu begins to kick Goku on the other side. The other one's kicking him back. This is really, really intense stuff goku gets beat so bad he gets kicked right into the fire hydrant and that's when zamasu's standing there and goku says i mean damn it both of them are just as strong as the original i mean how is this possible and supreme kai is shaking he's saying wait so how are there two immortal zamasus i mean things could get i mean things couldn't be any worse can they and vegeta is watching goku get kicked around like a dog he's getting kicked around and as he turns around he sees mai she's down she, he sees trunks he He's down, Trunks is bleeding out, everyone's dying, Goku's dying, everyone is dying, and at that very point, Vegeta erupts in a massive state of anger and saying, you motherfucker, and he begins to power up so, so dramatically, this reminded me of when Beerus slapped Boma, in which, you know, Vegeta said, my Boma, and he charged in, and he saved Goku, but what he did, instead of charging at Zamasu, he kicked the ever so holy shit out of Goku, he kicked Goku so far back goku went flying vegeta turned right back around he looked at everybody vegeta's like what are you doing and then that's when trunks woke up he looked up he begins to protect mai and that's when vegeta unleashes his massive gamma burst he powers up all his energy the two merged zamasus don't know what's going on and vegeta unleashes the gamma burst on both zamasus and just as he fires that off it is a tremendous blast i would have to say probably much much more ferocious than the final flash as the entire earth is beginning to shine there's nothing left of either merge zamasu there's nothing left the only thing left of merge zamasu are his hands his feet his body parts he's been destroyed and then we see supreme kai say zamasu has been blown into pieces with goku having to say that's no good vegeta he's just gonna regenerate with vegeta having to say you were on the verge of death just for a moment ago dad you have to come back and trunks is like dude like we, we have to get out of here because he's gonna pull himself back together and that's what supreme kai says we need to escape now while we have the chance and that's when goku says 
Did you just say escape? We can't just leave Zamasu to do as he pleases, and just as everyone feared, Zamasu begins to pull himself back together. However, now there are multiple copies of Merge Zamasu, and that's when Goku's like, give me a freaking break, how the hell did he multiply again? So now, we have various different copies of Merge Zamasu, and that's when the manga chapter ends. So it looks like this is gonna drag on even more, because now we got tens of dozens of Zamasu's and Supreme Kai's only way out is saying we have to escape while we have the chance. So post your comments down below guys, what did you guys think of this manga chapter? Did you guys like it? Did you guys hate it? Go on ahead and share this video guys as I am the first one to review this. So of course if you guys want to go on ahead and read up on the manga yourselves, the link is down below guys. Thank you all for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a like down below if you guys are new to the channel. Don't forget to go on ahead and punch that subscribe button guys for more news, information, and updates. I enjoyed this manga I just didn't like how by the end of it there's still more I mean just when you thought everything was gonna be over and done with there's more and I would have loved to see Vegito fight just a tad bit more but now we have Goku who fought Zamasu now they're all fighting a bunch of Zamasu's it's it's incredibly intense stuff so make sure you guys tune back in for more information as the days come on by thank you all for watching guys once again tune back in for more and I'll be seeing you all down in the comment section below have a great day guys peace